I think the Tusculum head would probably be the best starting point if you wanted to scan and reproduce a face of what Caesar actually looked like. I think it's the most realistic starting point. The Tusculum Caesar is over 2,000 years old, and historical records indicate the bust was carved when Caesar was 50 years old. The original is fragile and could easily be damaged by handling or even sunlight, so an exact duplicate is provided for the first ever laser scan and rendering of the face of Caesar. The head is scanned, a laser recording every detail. From the laser scanning, a kind of human topographical map is created, the peaks and valleys of Caesar's face. Then, months of rendering take every pixel and create its color, texture, and tone. The results give us a new look at a 2,000-year-old face. The face matches many of the descriptions of Caesar written during his lifetime. There is the deeply wrinkled brow, the large eyes with crow's feet, a prominent nose known as a Roman nose, thin lips, creased cheeks, jutting cheekbones and chin, a scraggly neck with saggy folds of skin. Here is the great emperor in his prime, around age 50. The new face of Caesar is shown to historian and scholar Antony Cam. He has studied the life of Julius Caesar for decades. I'm sure the nose is right. That's a Roman nose. A forehead of an intellectual. He was a towering intellectual. The eyes are dark. They are staring through one, as I'm sure he did, uh, not only with his subordinates, with his staff, but also, I would guess, his women. We do have really rich details from the literary sources of what Caesar looked like. So we hear that he had these huge black eyes that he'd used to woo women and a few whispers men as well from time to time. The Tusculum head also preserves one of the less flattering characteristics, his baldness. Julius Caesar was perhaps the Donald Trump of his day. He was known to comb forward his hair as much as possible, and he enjoyed wearing laurel wreaths because they covered up his lack of hair. Is this the true face of Julius Caesar? I think the Tusculum head of Caesar is about as close as we will ever get to knowing what he looked like. It certainly has the power that one would expect from him and I'm absolutely fascinated to see it.